It's beer o'clock on Real Old Craft Beer. Today we've got a beer from Yeasty Boys and it's a bottle of their Pot Kettle Black. It's a South Pacific Porter at 6% ABV. There's a look at the label. Black bottle cap. Let's get the beer out into a glass and see what we get. The beer was kindly sent to us by beersofeurope.co.uk. You can actually see the, the head of the beer climbing up the the bottleneck there. If I shake it hard enough, I'm pretty sure it'll come at the top. There we go. So, beer in the glass. Yes, most definitely looks like a, a porter. I'm not entirely sure what a South Pacific porter is. Probably just that it's been brewed in New Zealand. It's got a two finger tan coloured head, more or less a jet black coloured ale in the glass with nice levels of rolling carbonation. Let's get the aroma. Yeah, it's, this beer's won a few awards in New Zealand and I can see why. It's got a fantastic tar like roasted coffee, very bitter chocolate aroma. Nicely carbonated ale. As I said, you can pick it up from beersofeurope.co.uk. You can have a look at the description, the, the link in the description box. Check it out. I'm going to dive in. Cheers. Very drinkable beer. First thing you get is like a pipe tobacco smoke. Bittery, smoky, dark chocolate, bitter coffee kind of mouthfeel. Instantly, as soon as that beer kind of touches your mouth, hits your palate, it's instant roasted malt bitterness on the back end. But interestingly enough, it holds on to the drinkability. It's still a very drinkable, refreshing beer. It has got a nicely rounded mouthfeel with hints of vanilla and chocolate. It's quite vinous. There's some, there's some nice red wine, kind of black currant, raspberry kind of flavours going on there in the background. Plummy figgy, that type of kind of dark fruit going on. But it's a real good quality brew. If I had this in a pub or a bar, I might be inclined to drink this beer all night. It's just one of them really good solid brews that you could enjoy all evening long. Nice carbonation as you rock the beer around in the glass. You can see that carbonation chasing the head of the glass there. Very nice, nice, nicely presented beer. As I mentioned, uh, it's a refreshing licorice kind of mouthfeel and flavour um, with, with with some bitter chocolate. It, it's a good beer, some coffee in there. It's very vinous. Mouth feels great. I think it's my first, my first ever porter from New Zealand. 6% ABV. Let's give it a rating. For me, it's a really, I, I can understand why this beer has won some awards. Uh, at a beer festival, you can judge up anywhere up to 60 to 70, maybe even 80 beers if you judge in the final. And when you get to the final, when you get to them kind of semi-final stages, you need something to be big and bold and flavoursome. Because you, you're drinking so many other beers, so, such a range of beer that you need something to kind of stand out. And this beer stands out with the flavour. So... I can imagine it getting to the semi-final, rolling onto the final, and then just kind of winning it because of the just the amount of flavour in the beer. This beer's 
a very much kind of a 9 out of 10 beer for me. It's a, it's a big rating, it's a very nice beer, very solid for this category. I could drink it all afternoon and that's what it's all about. Would I buy the beer again? Yes, I would. You can pick it up from beersofeurope.co.uk. Uh, check the link out in the, in the description box. Uh, please comment, please subscribe and cheers.